Why? Hello and welcome everybody. It is Pox again. So today I wanted to go ahead and kind of go over uh, one of the races that I just recently participated in, which was the Mistress of Flame, I believe it was. Um, and it was essentially kind of like Descent, if you guys have run Descent before. So I'm, I'm using this new headset, it's confusing the hell out of me. So basically, um, the way it works is you essentially progress through the game, and as you're progressing through the game, um, it's like these preset, predetermined layouts. You will find these chests at the end of the areas, uh, and it's typically a choice of two rewards, and depending on the reward you pick, you know, uh, from the chest you'll get like different currency drops or you'll get uh, different equipment, you know, such as like coral rings or iron rings, etc. Um, kind of leading towards if you're playing caster or if you're playing, um, I guess you could say like melee. You know, it really, it really depends based on that. Um, and I ended, up, I ended up doing okay. I got like top 200. Um, I could have done significantly better, but it was my first time in the race and I didn't really know what chest to pick from. In fact, at one point in time, I didn't even pick from the chest and I completely skipped it. Which is really not what you should do because that was basically when I got my heralds. So I'm going to go ahead and speed through this um, just slowly so you guys can kind of see some of the footage. Uh, I ended up going kind of like a trapper style because it wasn't too bad I thought. Uh, I went uh, lightning trap with fire trap and bear trap. Unfortunately my fire link, or sorry my fire trap and my bear trap never even saw a two link. They were on a one link the whole time. Uh, but we did have some pretty good success with Lightning Trap once we got that. So I'm going to speed up to when we got Lightning Trap because that's kind of like when it gets a little bit more interesting here. Let me actually go back here. Once we got Lightning Trap, the game pretty much significantly sped up. And we just had that in a three link with basically multi trap with, uh, multi -trap with added lightning. Um, and that's pretty much it. And then it's just, just uh, Lightning Trap. And I pretty much was just going all deeps. So I have like two HP nodes. And it worked out pretty well. Um, the clearing was definitely a lot of fun. The race itself was a lot of fun. I don't really like the standard races. Um, like Basically, like running through the axe all over again just really isn't very fun to me. I think the ones when you start off in like Act 2 and stuff are not too bad. Um, and things like this really catches an eye to me as a person who's been playing the game for so long. Uh, just because, you know, especially with beta right around the corner, not that many people really want to restart all over again from level one, from act one, for, you know, a two to three hour race. Some people love it. Don't get me wrong. It's just not really my style. Uh, so I'm more down for things like this and like the endless ledges um, and potentially even like the Uber Beyond and the Uber other stuff. Even though that's starting from level one, it's just a lot more fun because it's just... I don't know, you're not really used to it, you know? I really do want to do one of the Exiles Everywhere race too because that was a ton of fun. Uh, but let me go ahead and show you guys this boss kill because it was pretty sketchy. Where is it? Somewhere over here? Okay, this is when I killed her. This was like a really long fight and I didn't really know what to do at first um, because, I mean, this, I've never done anything like this before, right? So I'm pretty much, I've got no heralds, I have no real form of single target damage, and I've got negative 5 resist on top of that, or negative 5 fire, and this is in merciless difficulty because of the way the race is set, so my resistances are just like complete ass, um, and my damage is definitely really not too good either. Thankfully, uh, the reason why I'm using a large life flask down here is because it actually rolled seething, and I've got another seeding that I rolled, uh, which is on my number one flask, so that's a seeding giant. And then I just had a regular giant flask. I didn't really have to worry about mono regen at all. And the reason why I didn't have to worry about mono regen at all is because just clarity pretty much solves that issue. Uh, unfortunately as well, my bear trap did not do enough damage to actually root this boss. And piety is really scary in her pure fire form. Like, Mikay, relax. Like, really scary because she doesn't ever stop. Uh, so if I killed her faster, as you can see here, it doesn't look like I'm, I'm doing much progress on that. I probably would have been like an extra 50 ranks further because I mean, this was like a, this was itself was like a 10 minute fight. Let's see, 16, we're fighting. I'm going to speed up to 19 here um, and see what happens. Oh, just kidding. I guess it wasn't that long. <laughs> okay. Um, but basically the first attempt in didn't really work. So I went back to go gather some more flasks which was pretty dangerous. And you can see I'm competing against the timer. The league is ending in four minutes. I was like, shit, dude, I gotta go get some flash charges. Uh, and these mobs are pretty scary too, man. The mobs are like, I don't know, six levels higher than me. I've got negative resistance. Like these mages can stun lock me because of how much damage, um, like the fire elemental portion deals. So let me go ahead and just like jump this forward a little bit, not too much. 
Okay, I think it's I think it's around here where I go a little bit suicidal, or not. No, we're back at the mages. I'm just kidding. Kids, remember, editing is your best friend. Here we go. So this is when it gets a little more fun because I decided to properly utilize multi trap and I kind of did like a, a suicidal attempt, but uh, it actually worked out really well. Or basically, I saw the boss and I'm like, all right, bitch, come here, and I just threw a ton of lightning traps and just forced her to run through them over and over and over while I clenched my butthole and just kept running. Um, <laughs> and I mean, I don't think this is the common method that racers use, but you know what, damn it, this was the method I used it. Honestly, like I said, I could do much better. Uh, I could do significantly better if I um, really just, you know, sat there and planned it out and memorized the map layouts and whatnot. I'm, I'm old and rusty, boys. I'm a, I'm a washed up PoE player now. Uh, you know, really just excited for the beta. But overall, I do have to say I had a lot of fun with this Mistress of Flame kill. Um, I, yeah, so I would encourage you guys to definitely check it out if you're curious for stuff like that. But anyway, I just wanted to keep you guys a little updated with what's been going on. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed yourself. Yeah, hope you guys I, I had a lot of fun. Sorry if you're hearing me talk twice. Uh, yeah. Uh, but anyway, if you enjoyed the content, please feel free to like, share, and subscribe. And remember, you can catch me streaming live every day at twitch.tv slash box. Hope you guys have a wonderful time, and I'll see you boys all tomorrow.